Hey YouTubers, Tess Jess One here. Um, I have got an unboxing to do. It's um, yes, it's copped a couple of bit beatings, but it um, seems to be okay. Not too many creases on the sides and stuff. Okay, and uh, that's what I'll open it up. Yeah, I assume this is the uh, it's a calendar of some sort. It's uh, 20 years of so uh, of sideshow art. So yeah, it'd be interesting to see what that's like when I open it up. <coughs> and they're just yes, fellas, yes, fellas, yes, fellas. I have got it. I have got this beautiful piece. I love the boxing. It is just well made. Looks leather. It's got the bullet holes that look like they've been a little bit of a split in the um, in the fold of my cover. It doesn't I'm not too phased about it. Yeah, decoration piece there, which. Pretty much similar to the front. Yeah, that's completely ripped. That box, this here, it's completely ripped. Disappointing, actually. In that in the top corner. Anyway, just want to get to where what the juice is about. And the juice is about this. Wow. Wow. That is the uh, end of his life, his endoskeleton life. Underneath that cybernized skin. Oh, geez, that looks good. Oh, that looks good. I'll have to um, get that up and running very soon. Dying to see that. Looks really good, doesn't it? Looks... I'm not going to show you too much the details of uh, this this figure because it's already been done. Uh, Xenomorph. It's got a brilliant camera and uh, a couple of other guys out there. The Malo MRA did a quick video and. I must say, very impressed. Very impressed. It's almost like that knee, the steel, the steel knee, is a little bit bigger than the normal leg. So I'm thinking, why is this so? But not uh, nitpicking too much, but. Yeah, I'd like to do a circumference measurement of that and because he looks like he's got a really big knee. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> that chest looks great. Yeah, all the nuts and screws and bolts are visible. The flesh, not too bad. A few touch ups to bring it to life. And the face sculpt's brilliant. The code's not much different to the original MS version, you know, so I'm not, uh, yeah, not much different at all. I love the bullet holes and the, and the visible blood you can see coming out of it. Um, uh, the shirt doesn't have bullet holes in the back of it, so I would have liked to have seen uh, the holes still there. Seeing as they've ripped the front and put bullet holes at the front, so it doesn't matter. That's, that's, that's cool. The hands look great, the gloves look great. All two, four, six, so eight, including the ones he's wearing. Looks fantastic. 
Actually, I'm, I'm not. T I'm going to um, put this up next to my MS versions, my original Terminators, because um, I think in certain poses you wouldn't really be able to tell much difference if you put them in certain poses. And uh, I pretty much want to seal the deal unless we get the police shirt out version. Um, having this as my finale piece and my two originals, so. I'll um, pose him pretty much with the with the mangled head and just have my Corone T1000 mmm actually there's there's hardly there's no scuff marks in that whatsoever. So for the sacrifice of saying do you want a split box, which I reckon has had an impact on the corner, uh, or have a scratched chrome piece of the 1000, I'd say I'd rather have a damaged box. So thank you very much for damaging my box. Oh, I love it, yep. Love it. So what I'm going to do, I'm gonna sw I'll swap. I want to get the wires coming off him and all that stuff, you know. So I really want to dig all that out. Um, I'm not really fussed about showing you all the accessories. But you've seen it all. You don't want to see it again. Trust me, you don't want to see it again. I get my cloth out because I don't want to put my fingers all over my and I've got the oh jeez I've forgotten the actor's name doesn't matter I'll put it in the um, down here the captions yeah got that I'm not going to touch it I want to put the get the cloth out and then but I, want, I hate putting fingerprints on chrome I've got a bit of a funny thing about putting fingerprints on chrome I never believe it always come, it comes off completely. So yeah, I'll have to get some cloth. So forgive me for my shoddy display of showing of the head. Still can't remember the actor's name. That feels a lot heavier. Interesting. Interesting, why is it so heavy? Anyway. that one off. I'm still using the cloth. Fantastic. You look so cool. Needs a bit of a polish up. You. Wow. So yeah, as I said, I'm not going to show you all the accessories. You've seen it all. You know it's there, what's in the box. I know what's in the box. I've seen plenty of videos. So what I'm going to do is just put my bits and pieces of this together. It's a good piece. It has got some uh, it's, yeah, I wouldn't rave about it. I mean, it's it's brilliant, but yeah, I would have liked a bit more detail. I'm not sure about the knee. It just seems to be fatter, wider. So I'm not sure if it's because of the gathered skin or the flesh or. Mm. But anyway, tough pickies you get where you're given. Worth three hundred. Yes, it's worth 300. I'd be telling a fib if I said no. You, you, know, you get some heaps of stuff with it. And uh, so I'm going to put my favourite parts to this uh, T800. Put my favourite parts to this um, and display them. Okay, guys, give me some time and I will. You gonna stand or what? There you go. 
It looks very cool. Okay, guys, so I'm just gonna put it all together and then I'll show you. Catch up. My room, room is so full of rubbish that I really need to clear out. Fingers crossed I'm get that bigger house than I'm after in the next month or so. Then I'll have plenty of room. Okay, so catch you soon. Hey guys, I got all the uh, the parts that I wanted to put on on. Uh, uh, yeah, I've got to say it's a it's a, <laughs> it's a pretty cool piece. Um, yeah, I've got no problems putting my uh, my battle damage with my original MS versions. Uh, Terminators, I still love them. Um, still always will. Um, yeah, so there you go. There's the my newest, my latest. He looks so cool. Even if he has a big knee. <laughs> but, yeah, don't go out measuring the guy's leg now because I said so. <laughs> uh, oh god, I like the stir trouble sometimes. Anyway, it's all in fun. All you collectors that have got one out there, congrats. And uh, if it's in the post, guys, be patient and uh, you'll get there. Uh, I, I, I was patient. Okay, till the next time. Test Jess one out. Catch ya.